Hi guys, it's Eve Robbins again, and this is Hyperpin. Uh, this is the front end to the new project I'm working on, which is a uh, virtual pinball machine. A bit like I've got the arcade machine downstairs in a, a PC and an arcade cabinet. This is going to be a PC and a pinball table. So, um, in a minute, I've got it on a 19 inch screen this side and a 17 inch screen, screen this side. This has been rotated to be a play field, and this is a back glass, so this would be where we have high scores and bits and bobs appear. And the front end I'm using is called Hyperpin. So it's a really nice um, front end, a bit like Maximus System Aim. This is the pinball variation of it. So we can press the flippers, go left and right, which in this case is a shift. So um, Hyper Pin is a front end for future pinball, which is really nice 3D uh, pinball tables. And it also emulates virtual pinball which is more uh, real life pinball machines that people have recreated so we'll jump in to this one uh, so you've got your black glass here that would emulate your scoreboard uh, and all this kind of jazz and on your left hand screen I've got the play field so usually this would be above this screen here sort of angled like a real pinball ta table but at the minute it's a work in progress on my desk so you can see here we've got virtual pin main which runs the, the scoreboard We'll hit go, and then you're playing Back to the Future Pinball. It's a really nice emulation of it. This is a virtual virtual pinball. This one is or uh, virtual pinball nine, as I should say. So it's a really nice way of playing pinball machines without paying thousands uh, for the pinball machine themselves. Um, all these are downloadable from the web. Um, virtual pinball tables you can get from vpforums.org and future pinball are scattered all over the web because whereas uh, virtual pinball are representations of existing arcade, existing pinball machines or past pinball machines future pinball are uh, new ones they're not in existence in real life there's no real life counterpart for that, like those pinball tables so I'm going to jump into a a future pinball table and show you what a future pinball table looks like. So let me find one that's good. So yeah, we'll try that one. Dead Hunters. It's quite a good one. This is so. Like I say, future pinball is quite 3D. It's really flash. Uh, the back glass on here will change into the actual pinball table when it loads. Um, but these are very very 3D so you need a good PC to run these tables as opposed to virtual pinball you can get away with a, a lower spec PC um, my pinball machine emulator that's on the uh, arcade machine that I've got uh, that runs quite fine on a um, onboard Intel graphics card with a old Pentium 4 whereas this just it won't touch it will just crash and die so um, as you can see this one's quite quite a lot more 3D, quite a lot shinier. So I'll we'll stick the camera here, show you a bit of gameplay on this and then we'll jump back into a normal pinball table, so a virtual pinball table, uh, just so you can see the difference in gameplay and graphics. So I won't bother showing you the the backboard for this, so that's the backboard. There's not a lot happening on it at the minute, it's a little tiny scoreboard at the bottom, so we'll just jump into this one so Stick some coins in, hit player one, gives a bit more volume. This one's got four, this table itself's got four sub games built into it. So, this one we're playing is called Zombie Attack. So, as you can see, you've got the player board in the middle of the black section. You have bad guys pop up on that, you can get bonus points for shooting and some really nice 3D effects on this one so lots of anti-aliasing going off um, this PC coats with it quite nicely this has got a 4870 in it from ATI um, like I say this won't run on an onboard graphics card it'll just cry a death it either won't load or it'll be so unplayable it's unreal so it's, there's quite a few tables now being made by the future of more the guys that make future pinball tables that are making quite a lot of recreations of older ones but with a, a new twist so there was a, quite a lot coming out because the 
resurgence of pinball is getting a bit crazy. It's a bit like uh, Mames put a bit of a resurgence into arcade machines. This has put this and virtual pinball have put a resurgence onto pinball because it's really easy to get hold of pinball now. So rather than going on eBay and spending fifteen hundred pounds for a table that you'll play all the time, you can download a few and run it on a decent PC. So play a bit more with hyper in here. So you've got the hyper pin wheel at the bottom there that you move from left and right. Gives you a nice little pop up of what the game's called. So you can see what's now and next and as you skip through the games the back screen changes so so if I was to press enter there so no one's not got this game you just get a little pop up saying oh, I can't find this game you just hit enter again um, so I'll find a good virtual football table so you can see what the difference between the two are so we'll jump into an Indiana Jones and I've got that one so Again, this has got the back screen. On virtual pinball tables, it is a JPEG or PNG, sorry, um, with the scoreboard that overlays it. So it's a little bit different. So that's the playfield. You can see it's not quite three, quite as 3D. So you've got a little bit of 3D in it. Um, that's a slight problem there with the rendering of it on an ATI graphics card. So virtual pinball at the minute, because the guy that writes it doesn't have access to ATI graphics cards, he writes them for NVIDIA graphics cards. So they're not really optimised. So you do get the odd problem there, like uh, see-through textures or transparency doesn't quite work properly. So you'll have uh, things like spinners and the on this one. And then there's a fault with the uh, paddles. So if I press the paddle you can see it if I don't. It's very transparent. So, so they're pretty much the same to play. You know, they're quite enjoyable to play. Even they are quite old. I mean this is a from the eighties I think this is from. So turn that down a little bit. So it's quite a good table this is, it's, uh, I think it's the Redux table, so it might be from the late 80s, early 90s this table. So what a crazy multi ball going on there at the minute. So yeah, that's a virtual pinball table, you just hit escape and it takes you back to this. Um, so yeah, that's um, Hyperspin and uh, the new desktop pinball machine that I'm working on. Uh, fingers crossed I'll have it into a box at some point. Um, Ideally, I'd like this screen to be about 40 inches and this to be about 19, ideally, and possibly get a DMD monitor just to run the scoreboards, uh, but that's, yeah, a wishful thinking at the minute, so, so yeah, that's Hyperspin, uh, if you've got any comments, stick them in the box below, I'll stick as many links as I can find for table sites and forums to help you guys build your own virtual pinball table, and I'll stick those in the box below. As always, you can get me on email at evilbobbins at evilbobbins.com, and I'll see you guys later.